Rumors are swirling that Meghan tried to buy her way onto Vogue's best dressed stars of the week list, but still found herself at the bottom of the poll when the results came out. But before we fill you in on the details, please subscribe to the channel to keep up with all the antics the Sussexes may be up to. Let's start. Despite not being an atop list celebrity, Meghan managed to land a spot in this week's coveted fashion poll conducted by Vogue magazine. Speculation is rife that her entry was greased by none other than WME, who allegedly purchased her a spot alongside other stars like Taylor Swift. Taylor Swift herself dazzled the crowd at the premiere in a blue Oscar de la Renta gown, complete with a daring cutout design. Beyonce's appearance was also stunning. She spotted a futuristic Laquan Smith dress with a metallic bodice. She was a fitting presence at the premiere, given that her concert special, Renaissance, is about to grace our screens very soon. These top list celebrities who managed to make it to Swift's big night brought the glitz and glamour to the event, proving that not even a Hollywood strike can dim their star power. Jennifer Lopez also had her fashion moment in a Daniel Roseberry strapless cream column dress, complete with regal draping. Of course, not all fashion moments are winners, and Meghan's escapade this week was a prime example. Vogue opened a poll with a list of 10 nominees, and Meghan found herself at the bottom of the list for her off-the-shoulder outfit she sported in New York. While some may have been surprised by her inclusion, a Twitter source unveiled a more calculated effort to display Meghan's fashion choices and media releases. What's intriguing is that Vogue seems to have collaborated with various entities to showcase Meghan's fashion choices. This collaboration, as indicated earlier, extends to multiple Hearst publications among them, Harper's Bazaar and Country Magazines. Allegations arise that a mental health event was instrumental in this campaign, and one can't help but wonder if WME dug deep into its pockets to ensure Meghan's pictures graced the pages of Vogue. Ironically, Vogue recently unveiled the results for Best Outfit of the Week poll, and it was no surprise that Meghan had the least number of votes. It just goes to show that even if you pay for a spot in the magazine, the people's choice is a different matter. Social media was quick to respond to Meghan's foray into Vogue's list, with many fans criticizing her choice of outfit for such a formal and educational event. The verdict is clear, and it seems like people are not buying the act, highlighting the line between genuine style and orchestrated appearances. Please subscribe to the channel for more updates like this. Turn on the bell and thank you for watching.